Thank you, Dr. Sanjay, and congratulations for this wonderful conference in 2023 in Bangalore. So um, I'm going to share my screen. So today's my topic is 4D bioprinting and hyper-personalized skin regeneration, especially to explain this digital healthcare innovation for diabetes food care. Well, let me start with the fourth industrial revolution of a 4D bioprint. Well, when I start the stem cell research in the United States and my dental school, well, I tried to learn the differentiation of cells. And at the time, I did a lot of work for 2D cell culturing and spirit type of culturing. And also, I used some of the scaffold to manage the, some specific type of cells differentiation. However, since I joined my team at Rocket Healthcare and I worked together with a lot of doctors, together with especially uh, Arikem, a biotech uh, company in India, I learned we can actually print the cells together with the scaffold. And this is uh, one of the idea how we develop our new uh, treatment method, especially for diabetes food care. Why we need to use 3D bioprinter it is because 3D bioprinter is one of the best tool to mimic the human body. If you see the right panels, we normally see the cells by manual way by hand. However, if you have a 3D bioprinter, which actually has uh, all the parameters that can, you can see the cells, it's single cell by cells with the parameters behind the software and hardware, you can see the difference of the preparation after seven days or later, which means that the best uh, preparation means the better uh, differentiation you can control. So now we uh, developed the breakthrough biotech digital medical device technology, which are normally related to the 3D bioprinter named the Doctor in Vivo, an artificial intelligence software that doctor can easily handle this 3D, 4D bioprinter together with your team, and also disposable medical device kit, which you can use for its procedures in operating theater. So uh, we firstly developed this, all the, uh, the technology, especially for the skin regeneration and targeting diabetes food care. Well, I'm going to skip this introduction because you already understand how the uh, diabetes and diabetes food ulcer is risky uh, for our friends, family, and all the people around the world. So our AI digital technology can summarize a single six different steps. Firstly, we use artificial intelligence software to take an image file to transfer the 3D bioprinting version of the file. At the same time, this AI can detect only the wound area to mimic the patch uh, uh, shape of the, uh, the ECM patch later on. And then the doctor can have all the information of the size of the wound and the depth of the wound and how much bio ink will be necessary. And we normally focus on the autologous system, which means that we print patient own tissue. Normally we harvest the patient adipose tissue by um, the abdomen part or thigh or even the pad area. And we use this disposable kit, which name is Derim kit to uh, micronize the adipose fat tissue to make it you know, possibly a uh, use as a bio ink together with our 3D, 4D bio printer doctor in vivo. The printing time will be surely a few minutes in a fresh way in front of the patient. And we apply back this patch directly to the wound site, like what you see here in the last movie clips. So this is the one of the example of the diabetes food care uh, procedures. Firstly, we're taking an image without ruler because we use a deep learning system of the AI software, and we print the two different patch because a uh, one patch will be eight centimeter by s eight centimeter uh, in a maximum. But this is a printing. Uh, uh, the system, which means that as much as if you have a bio ink, you can keep print. So for this patient, we print the two different uh, shape of the patch and we freshly apply back to the wound site. But finally, we only covering this patch with a normal dressing material and the weekly base we follow up with a, a clean dress change. 
Well, this whole idea is not a new, honestly, because we already understand what is important for chronic wound treatment, which means that we need a good source to triggering the cells migration, preparation, and also differentiations. But compared to the normal wound, chronic wound normally has a lower number of v, lower uh, level of VGF, TGF, beta, and EGF, FGF, and how about the impaired angiogenesis? So we want to derive the good source from adipose tissue, normally good source of the EGF, TGF, and the all uh, VHF, all the growth factors and cytokines. But how we can deal with this type of the good source? Well. We simply want to uh, print this ECM patch. Well, exocellular matrix, ECM is uh, 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 the, comes from the uh, patient on tissue as I described in the beginning. And by using this 3D, 4D bioprinter in AI software behind, you can just click several times to manage the finer uh, customized shape of the ECM patch that you can derive for uh, back to the on the site. And this is the uh, the follow up the research with uh, 12 weeks with the upper um, the pictures what you already saw. Well, normally this only happening with a one time treatment and you can even see the edge area, the keratinocyte finally migrate to the wound area and the dormer site, uh, the uh, fibroblast, fibroblast cells actually differentiate to produce more collagen to fill them up. So firstly, this doctor in vivo 3D and 4D bioprinter system is the dispensing autologous patient material into customized ECM matrix, as I uh, explained. This has been published together with Dr. David Armstrong's team and Dr. Raja, uh, Dr. Um, the Jalen's teams in the United States already. Uh, and uh, we actually described the, how we actually deal, uh, deal with this a high technology called 3D bioprinter. And this AI assist deep learned wound detect and 3D file generator, which we call the AID region systems, because this has a high accuracies and the better quality of the software that doctor can use it during their procedure simply to control the uh, 3D, 4D bioprinter doctor in vivo. This uh, work has been uh, described and published one of the uh, big journal, the name, the computer vision and pattern recognitions impact score. Well, finally, the STERI medical device kit is autologous adipose tissue micronization disposable and printing accessories. Half of them are actually disposable accessories of the 3D, 4D bioprinter doctor in vivo. And another part uh, will be the medical device that doctor can easily handle with a patient on tissue to manage the bio ink finally. This work has been published with five different clinical trials in India, Korea, United States, and Turkey and Malaysia with the great uh, uh, the medical teams. Well, all the uh, publication, what related to our uh, clinical trials with the 3D, 4D bioprinting system has a specific inclusion and exclusion criteria. Uh, however, we only focus on the uh, ischemia and infection uh, 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 the uh, level for the patient, because no matter type 1 and 2 diabetes, and no matter the age, uh, sex, and also the size of the ulcers, we all cover it uh, with this system because this is a hyper-personalized uh, regenerative treatment method. So another clinical trial from a Korean group, Dr. Nam Gung-sik and uh, Sung Gyo Hans, we actually had uh, no limitation of the exposure wound and uh, no uh, uh, limitation of the size, even the open toe and the uh, uh, the amputated uh, foot, we all can cover. One of the example is like what you see here. And this research has been concluded with one-time treatment after three months. And other clinical trials from Turkish group, actually they do the comparison study with the skin graft because we want to also delight with not only the fast wound healing, but also good quality of the skin regeneration compared, uh, uh, the, uh, the compared to the, all the other classic way to uh, treatment for the diabetic foot patient. As you see here uh, in the figures from the week zero, we actually covering the ECM patch once. And after two weeks later, you also can observe that this already closed almost a hard percent. And then the, at week four, 
uh, the doctor did the skin grafting with the upper island, but he leave the bottom island as is after one time treatment from the beginning. So finally, after a 10 weeks later, you can see the result of the skin grafting and also our 3D, 4D bioprinting systems. Well, this can promise the uh, high uh, efficacy and lower cost because it is only one time treatment with a better quality of the skin regeneration. And we actually want to uh, mention that this has a lower number of recurrence issues. Another publication came out from Malaysia group, Dr. Uh, uh, Yajit, uh, in Kuala Lumpur hospitals. And we do have a great research of uh, the fast healing compared to the other uh, treatment methods. Even the heal area with really close to the bone, uh, no matter it is because we can actually describe this, uh, the exact same shape and the size of the ECM patch with a, our AI digital healthcare system. So key benefit, well, firstly, this is the only way to use autologous patient on tissue as a material of the patch. And we do derive the over 80% of the efficacies and the fast healing and good quality that I already mentioned in the previous publications. And the no hospitalization will be necessary. And as I mentioned that uh, it has a promise for the lower uh, percentage of recurrence. We did already uh, observe a lot of in vivo and in vitro tests uh, confirmed this actually has not only for the skin covering, uh, but this is the fully aftalization with the neovascularization too. So as you already see, the patch looks like this and uh, all the uh, shape of the earth we can actually covering the this 4D bioprinting system. And I want to call this as a new era for hyperpersonalized diabetes for earth treatment with 4D bioprinting and artificial intelligence digital medical technology. So while well, my uh, slide is done, and uh, I especially want to thanks to all the pioneers who I met in India, uh, firstly, Dr. Sanjay Sharma and all the other doctors in each uh, area uh, who opened the new era for wound care and who really want to save our family, friends, and people, not only in India, but all the global, uh, uh, the worldwide people. So thank you so much. And I also want to thank you to our team at Archem Meditech, uh, who actually are a uh, brave heart and smart brain, who actually want to bring this technology ASAP to more patients, especially in India. Thank you. Thank you very much.